Hodges University proudly states they are one of the most premier private universities in the state of Florida. They are always making sure they are providing the best options for their students. And here to tell us more about their clinical mental health counseling program at Hodges is Dr. Ali Kyle Rausch. Good morning. Good morning. So happy to have you here this Thank morning. Thank you so much. I love talking about Hodges University. And again, you know, as I just kind of briefly mentioned, always kind of catering towards students. Um, I think the main goal, obviously, is when you go to college, when you go to university, you want a job at the end of uh, all your hard right. work, all your you know time that you put in, and uh, you were telling me that this mental health counseling really is kind of a, a growing field. Tell mm -hmm. us a little bit more. So I think one of the things that's kind of happened over the past few years is a recognition of the importance of mental health. Mm -hmm. We've seen um, some national tragedies that have kind of brought that to the mm -hmm. forefront, and that there's a piece of prevention that needs to be happening for people. And we've taken away some of the stigma around mm -hmm. mental health treatment. And so with that happening, um, you've really seen the field and the profession grow and, and people really wanting to get involved with it and people really being willing to get those services and treat themselves. I would imagine this is a rewarding career too once you get into it. I mean, I know it's got to be tough, you know, to deal, you know, in and out with the, you know, the, the things that you have to go through on a daily basis, but you are at the end of the day helping people, which there's a lot of people that are dealing with this. Absolutely. So talk a little bit about the program that uh, Hodges University uh, offers. And I know you've been with it for a couple years now, and I didn't even realize you guys had something like this. So right. I'm great, you know, I'm excited to tell our viewers about this. So our program's been up and running for about three years. We're an accredited, KCREP accredited mm -hmm. program. Um, and we're really meant for people who are working full time. Okay. Our goal is to really allow someone who has a full time job, has a family, mm -hmm. has all of those things happening in a normal life, the opportunity to further their education and mm -hmm. work in the mental health field. So this is a, a first, the first program, a master's program? Yep. Yep. It's a master's program. So um, you come in and it takes about three years okay. to get the master's degree and then you move on to get your license. Okay. Um, is it considered part-time or how does it, I mean, because I, I, I don't know, I mean, I, <laughs> people do it all the time, but it, I'd imagine it is hard for, you know, doing a right. family and all that and then on that on top of it. So right. what right. do people normally expect with that program? So usually people are taking two classes mm -hmm. at a time. Okay, two uh, classes a semester. So it, it, with master's programs, yeah. that looks a little bit different. Mm -hmm. That sounds like part-time, but really for us, that's yeah. full-time. Okay. Um, Mm -hmm. All right, and then who is the um, you know ideal candidate for this? Um, I mean, if they're already working, I mean, what kind is the career path for this? You know, it's hard to even say. It's yeah. really about somebody who has always had a passion for helping people, felt like maybe they're who people go to for mm -hmm. support, um, but want to have the skills mm -hmm. and the training to do it in a really professional way. Yeah. So we have people who have come from everything from police officers to ex-military oh. to um, old ex-doctors to someone who's um, even worked in HR and decided this is a shift they wanted yeah, to make. Yeah. So there's really no perfect candidate. Okay. Um, well, and then explain why Hodges, the program there, is maybe a little dip bit different than some of the others, okay. you know, that are offered in Southwest Florida. I know you, you know, you mentioned the fact that you're accredited, which mm -hmm. is uh, very nice. Right, and really important for the field. And the other piece, I think, for us, you know, I mentioned that we're really meant for somebody mm -hmm. who is working full time. And so if you're taking two classes, our classes are set up in a hybrid manner so that one day... Uh, you're on campus mm -hmm. and then the next week you're doing things online for that same class. Mm. But you're taking two classes at the same time, right? Yeah. So one week, you, let's say you're in my class and the next week, same day, you're in mm -hmm. Dr. Hoffman's class. So you're able to only come to campus one day a week yet take two classes, which really allows people to have that life yeah. we were talking about, mm -hmm. right? Um, and the other piece is just because it's a small university, we really focus on that one-on-one -on -one attention. And our classrooms are small. Experiential learning is a huge part of what we do. Mm -hmm. So when you come out of our classroom, you already have the skills to do yeah. some of these counseling things. We have a little bit less than a minute left. And besides the master's program, mm -hmm. I know you guys are also doing a lot of different things. Uh, yeah. Kind of share real quickly what else you guys are doing. So our faculty will go out into the community and mm -hmm. do some trainings as far as working in agencies and, and helping agencies in the community kind mm -hmm. of develop their staff. What we're also doing this year, we're just starting our first annual workshop. Uh, so it'll be an all-day workshop based on strengths-based approaches to help um, people really understand how to approach counseling from a strength-based perspective. Mm. 
So that will be in April this year, and it's meant for students. It's meant for professionals in the field already. Um, anybody who really wants to further what they understand yeah, about counseling. Yeah, yeah. Well, as we close here, if someone is interested in learning more about the program, the master's program certainly, um, and then just getting enroll, you know, enrolled in, at Hodges, you know, in general, what's the best thing for you? Uh, would you tell them to do? They can go a couple of different ways. They can contact admissions and get mm -hmm. that process started there, or they can contact any of us uh, mm -hmm. in the mental health counseling mm -hmm. uh, department so feel free to even send me yeah. an email about it so well thank you so much for being here this morning again I love talking about Hodges University and and the fact that you're really helping people you know find jobs at the end of their, their hard work 100% of our yeah. students end up employed in the field when That's they're done awesome so. we love it we love to hear that mm -hmm. thank you so much doctor thank you all right we'll send it over to Steph when it rains, it pours, especially here in Southwest Florida. Up next, the maids with the muscle are here to tell us how we can prepare our homes for the upcoming rainy season. Stick around.